So what we have here is the Ferramund Friction Hitch. And in my opinion, it's an upgrade from the Midshipman's Hitch uh, because not only is it a slip and grip, just like the other one, so I can move it along, but if I try and pull on it, it's not going anywhere. Uh, it also has this quick release, whereas the Midshipman's does not. So if I pull this, all of a sudden, this whole thing comes undone, uh, but it's still really easy to tie. So here we go. <clears throat> so I'm going to take my working end. I'm going to go around the, uh, this could be a tree, this could be a stake in the ground, whatever um, you're using to secure it to. And I'm going to make this little underhand loop. Uh, so I've just passed the working end kind of underneath. So let's just form this little loop. And then I'm going to go over the standing end and I'm going to wrap it around a couple of times just like I would with a Prusik knot. Um, and once I've done that, I'm now going to take my working end again, form a little bite, and go through that uh, little loop that I've gone around a couple of times with. Uh, and when I dress this knot, which is the most important part of this knot, um, and it's just making it look really nice and pretty, which also helps it function better because um, you want it to be wrapped around properly. Um, so when I tighten that up there, um, then I have my Fairman friction hitch. And I've only left myself a very little uh, bit of working end. Uh, normally you'd be able to, and you'd want to leave yourself more room here. Um, but there I have it. I can pull on this. It's not really going anywhere but I can slide it along just like I can with the midshipman's hitch. Uh, when I'm done with it, pull it and it slides right out.